Hey guys, welcome back for those that are coming back and for those that are new here, my name is Laura and I've gotten a lot of requests for this video so I thought I would share it with you and it is what I pack in my diaper bag. Obviously cloth diaper edition. So first of all, this bag is a rough and tumble bag. I have to start off by saying I would never buy this bag myself. I was lucky enough to rave about this bag to my husband enough that I was probably annoying, but he ended up getting me this for Christmas. It is just so expensive that I could not see myself buying it, but he surprised me for Christmas and that is why I have it. I've heard people absolutely loved it and I've also heard that it had gone through multiple kids so it held up amazing over time. And that is why I kept raving about it. And I think my husband just wanted to hear me stop talking about it. So that is probably why he got it for me for Christmas. But again, it is the rough and tumble bag. It is the boho bag, the original. So what is so special about this bag first is that this bag can go over your shoulder. It can be worn as a backpack. Two seconds. Or this strap that can be crossbody can also be shortened to just be an over the shoulder bag. So you can wear this bag many different ways. So I thought I would share that with you and let's get into what I pack. So this bag is packed for not a shorter trip, but a kind of in the middle trip where we're going to go out and about, but I don't know how long we'll be, but I know we won't be a while if that makes sense. So let's get right into what is in here. So I'm going to show you which pockets I'm digging into first. We have side pockets over here and there are more side pockets that I don't even use. That's how big this bag is. But in this first pocket here, we have Grace's little medical book that we use at our pediatrician. Whenever we go there, he writes Grace's weight and height down and he keeps it in there and gives it back to us. And then we also have in the next pocket down, all of Grace's little accessories. <laughs> we have some boogie wipes here. And then I have a Ziploc bag. And in here we have some pipette baby lotion. As you can tell, something's leaking. And we have active skin repair, the baby one. I swear by this stuff. Grace used to get those little cuts from her fingernails when she was a baby baby. I would put this stuff on and it was gone within a day. Highly, highly, highly recommend this stuff. And then this is the diaper bomb we normally use on Grace and it is the Earth Mama organic diaper bomb. And then we have the CJ's butter, the spritz in the warm vanilla cake. Now, as you can see, I haven't used this very often at all. And I've had this for a long while. The Earth Mama is definitely our go-to. So that is what is in this Ziploc bag here. Now, if you guys have any other options where you think I'd be able to fit this stuff in a different bag that's more sustainable, definitely leave it down below. I am a huge person for sustainability and reusing things. So this was the only thing big enough to carry all this stuff. Again, if you have a better option for me, make sure to leave it down below and I will definitely check it out. So that is what is in this bag. Then the pockets on this side, we have little snacks for Grace. So we have a pouch and then the teething wafers. And then we have my wallet, which is ginormous. And then we have another pocket over here, which we don't use. And then in the middle big section, we have two bibs. We have a Burt's Bees burp cloth. I love these burp cloths. I highly recommend those as well. And then we have a little change of clothes for Grace. So a long sleeve onesie and long pants since it's still pretty cold outside. And then the last thing in the big pocket here is a mini wet bag. And in the wet bag, we carry a little suction plate. And we carry this because whenever we're out and about, we don't know if we're gonna stop to eat or if where we're going, we're gonna eat. And with grace and plates and napkins and food, <laughs> it just doesn't go well. So the fact that this suction's down 
it's super easy when we're out and about to put her food in here and we don't have to worry about things flying around. Um, so that is why we bring that and we also bring her own little spoon. So that is what is in there. And then we have one more pocket in the back here and that is where we keep all of her diapering stuff. So in the back here, we have a receiving blanket. Now I use this as our changing pad. So whenever I go to change Grace, this is what I lay her on. Again, this is something that I'm looking to swap out. So leave your recommendations below. I'm looking for a changing pad that you guys love and is waterproof. I love to swap it out because obviously this is just a cotton receiving blanket. And while it does the trick, I'd love for something waterproof. So leave those recommendations down below. I would really appreciate that. And then as far as our diapering goes, we have a normal size wet bag. We don't have anything in the top here. We have two diapers though in the bottom here and some wipes. So I am someone who always carries two diapers with me and normally I carry dry wipes. So just a little stack of dry wipes. For the two diapers, I whenever we are going out and about, I pack the two diapers and whenever we come home, I unpack them if we don't use them because I have a good rotation going now. So I just pack and unpack the diapers when we're going out and then when we get home. So that is what I keep in our wet bag. Now I keep all of the clean stuff in the front pouch here and then when we have a dirty diaper, it just goes in the back pouch. So that is what is in there. I also carry just a shopping bag with us. I should probably just carry a normal wet bag, but this is what I carry. So as far as what's in my diaper bag, that is normally what we carry around. We also have this little pacifier holder on the side here. And Grace normally has her pacifier on a clip attached to her. So in here, I just have like one of those teething bananas. But as far as what is in our diaper bag, that's what's in our diaper bag. Let me know if you guys carry anything different. Do you carry more diapers, less diapers? What do you guys carry? Is there something I carry that you don't carry? I'm super interested to know. And again, guys, if you have those options for the switch for the Ziploc bag, and if you have any recommendations for the waterproof changing mat, please make sure to leave them down below. Thanks guys for sticking with me for this video and I will see you guys soon.